<laughs> Hi everybody. Today's musical instrument is a really fun one. I even brought my country hat. Can you give me a yee-haw? <laughs> Today, we're gonna make a diddly bow. A diddly bow, what is that? <laughs> That's a musical instrument that they used to make down south when they didn't have any money, but had a whole lot of stuff in the shed. Here we go. First, you're gonna need, need a piece of wood. Now, Susie Sunshine's wood is pretty wide. You don't really need it to be that wide. <laughs> and it's a little bit long so that it can make lots of music. Then, Susie Sunshine's is actually already painted. This was a beautiful piece of wood I had out on my patio for Halloween. <laughs> but today, it's gonna be a diddly bow. Then we need three screws or three nails. Then we need some steel string or a steel cord. Now Susie Sunshine is using something that she hangs up pictures in her house with. Now you'll know it'll work if a magnet will stick to it. Whoop, looks pretty good to me. <laughs> then of course we're gonna need a tin can and some special cutters for the steel. Here we go. <laughs> First, I want you to take two either screws or nails and put it in the two far ends of your wood. Screw them in pretty tight. That way they won't come out when we start making the musical instrument. Next, we're gonna take our steel string or steel cord and measure it the length of the board. Now, one of the things that you have to do with this is have a little bit of extra steel so that you can tie it on super tight so it doesn't come undone. Susie's had hers come undone a few times. Mm -hmm. Now, if you have a screw or a nail, you're gonna wrap the string around it and secure it super tight. I'm gonna go around it a few times so that I know it won't come undone. If the steel cord isn't tight enough, it doesn't really make music. Now we're gonna string it on the other end. Now Susie's screws actually have holes right there. So I can put it through there, but yours you might just wrap around and tie. Both work. <laughs> I like to think of all the different things that other people might have in their houses that they can use. So we'll wrap it around. super secure. Hey, that looks pretty good. Now we still have to fit our tin can under there. <laughs> We're going to take our tin can, put it under good and solid, and you'll see the ridges help keep it secure, a little bit anyway. And then move it up somewhere near the top of the bow. Now, just to make sure it doesn't go anywhere, we're gonna take another screw and put it right underneath. So it doesn't fall down. Good stuff. All right. <laughs> yeah. Are you ready? Oh my. Hey, do you know you can make different sounds? If you put a piece of metal down at the bottom, it'll change the note. 
sometimes people have like a metal thimble on their finger that they go up and down, but Susie doesn't have one. So we're just gonna push is a diddly bow.